Now in this video we will see about 4 bit incrementing burst. So in case of 4 bit incrementing burst, the tra first transfer will be non sequential. So we will see about 4 bit. We will see about INCR4 that is 4 bit incrementing burst. So in clock cycle T1 to T2, the first transfer is non sequential and the address will be a random address 0x38 and in clock cycle T2 to T3 it is a sequential transfer and the address will depend on the previous address. So previous address is 0x38 so it will increment by 4 bytes since the size of the data is h size is equal to 4 bytes. So according to this it will increment 0x38 to 0x 3c and in clock cycle t3 to t4 it is also a sequential so it will depend upon the previous address and it will increment to 0x 4 0 so total 1 2 3 and next in clock cycle t4 to t5 it is also a sequential transfer so the address will increment to 0x 44. 4. So total 4 beats have has been completed. If the size of the data is 8 bytes, then the initial address will be 0x 38. Next, the next address will be 0x 38 plus 8. Next, the initial ad next the address will be 0x 3c plus 8 bytes next the address will be so on so the address will be incrementing by 8 bytes whereas in case of wrap 4 in case of wrap 4 the initial address same the first transfer will be non sequential and the initial address is 0x38 and size of the data is 4 bytes and the size of the data is 4 bytes so it will the in the next clock cycle t2 to t3 the address will increment to 0x3c and in next clock cycle the address will not go to 0x40 since it is exceeding the 32 bit address boundary it is exceeding the 32 bit address boundary so it will come back to wrap around to 0x 3 0 and it will increment to 0x 3 4 so on. So this is the difference between the INCR burst and the RAB burst. So now let's see about uh, sorry this is 8 bit RAB burst. It is a RAB burst. So similarly here in clock cycle T0 to T1 the first transfer is non sequential and in the address is 0x 3 4 and next in clock cycle t1 to t2 the transfer type is sequential and the address is 0x38 it is incrementing by plus 4 bytes because the size of the data is word which is 4 bytes and next it is incrementing from 0x38 to 0x3c and next it will and this is the wrapping boundary so it will go to 0x20, next 0x24, 0x28, 0x2c, 0x30, so on. So total 8 bits has been completed by this. So it will end. So in case of INCR, it will go on from 0x3c to 0x40, 0x44, 0x48. It is it will not stop at the wrapping boundary address, it will go on increasing, incrementing in case of incrementing burst. So that's all about today's video. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video.